make this super, super quick. Are you an atheist? Yes. Why are you an atheist? Because of my wife. It's all her fault. <laughs> Let's just be honest. By the way, I'm Ty. Nice to meet you. Jim. Jim. So, what, what is... By the way, I'm Ty. Nice to meet you. Jim. Jim. So, what, what is your actual uh, capacity in the American Atheist? The American I am the Atheist? National Field Organizer with American Atheists, and I co-founded the local Tri-State Freethinkers here. Okay. Why so, do you think it's important for atheists to be more, I guess, open? Because we had a lot of open atheists here. To normalize atheism. And, and what I love about the shirt that was quoted by Lauren was, when equality is under attack, we must show up. That changes the way people view atheism. When we're protecting LGBT rights, women's reproductive rights, science, sex mm. ed, Let's be honest, religion is attacking all those things. Sure. So we must be in that space. Mm. We must organize, and that's my job, is to organize directors and local affiliates around the country to fight for equal rights for other people. And by doing so, we normalize atheism and put religion back in its place and back in the church where it belongs. How are you defining atheism, if you want me to ask? Just what makes an atheist to you? Uh, doesn't believe in God. There's no evidence. Right. So there's there's a lot of different kinds of atheists. Maybe they have different beliefs aside from the lack of belief in a God. Yes. Are those all represented in like the American atheists or like in other groups? Like, do you see equal representation of a variety of different ideas, or does it tend to be a very specific section of well, like well political you can spectrum? stereotype like here's the majority of us. Like, well, a They're majority of fans. atheists are yeah, they like Marvel. Like they should. Uh, they should. They, they're skeptical. They're critical thinkers. Mm, Not, there we go. But that doesn't mean just because you're an atheist, you're all those things. Right. Some people like DC. We're still friends. <laughs> Not, you know, Not around this table. You can go both ways here. Ooh, We're uh, fine. Uh, but the, so, so while a lot of the people have a lot of these things, that by just being an atheist doesn't mean and define that you are automatically those things. But I guess what I'm wondering is because they can be potentially so different, mm -hmm. how do you send out a message that you know, speaks to so many different people. And, and, and what is American thing. atheist doing atheism? Like, what should we be involved with? Mm. So I set three criteria that defines an atheist issue for us. Okay. And the first one is, if we're looking at an issue, question one, who's behind the issue? Okay. Is it religion? Like, or who's behind this issue? Number two, is this an equal rights issue? Is somebody being discriminated against? And the third is, is religion being offered as the answer? Like when mm. I became with American atheist, I did not think that I would be in the gun business or weather business. But when kids are getting shot and your solution is to offer thoughts and prayers and to put up in God we trust in schools, yeah. damn it, you just made that an atheist issue. Mm. So now we want, and, and our stance on when it comes to guns is we want science and facts. I'm not saying what it should be, but we want it to be evidence-based. You know, if you're blaming hurricanes on the gays in abortion, now I'm a weatherman. Like, you're forcing me into these issues. But that defines, and like I already said before, like on Planned Parenthood, women's reproductive rights, abortion, it's religion attacking that. If you took religion out of that argument, mm. let's be honest, we're not having a, a reproductive rights issue or a sex ed. While there's a few... Can I throw something at you? Yes. There are atheistic religions, if my, am I right by that? Like there are religions that don't have a centralized God figure that they believe, right? Buddhism. Buddhism, for example. Buddhism, uh, certain sex, Jediism. Sir, sex That's true, that's true. Uh, Jainism, yeah. So is really the religion the the antagonist here, or is it theism that's the antagonist? People use religion as their excuse to discriminate against people and to do their agenda. Okay. And, and mainly it is the Christian far right. Well, we can look at other religions, and in other countries, religion, their own religion, whether it be Muslim, Hindu, has all sorts of problems sure. that need to be fought. Anytime dogma, I mean, it's a problem. And those but also here, all tend to be theist religions. Right, right. but here, it's, it's the Christian right. I mean, that, that is our problem in our backyard. And so that is what we fight daily. And by doing that criteria that I set out, it makes it very clear on what issues and what space we should be in and what we should. Hmm. The other thing is there's a lot of intersectionality when it comes to transgender rights, when it comes to racial issues. We're fighting the same fight. A lot of times we're fighting the same people. Mm. You know, when you look at race issues, and other, we're, they're up, the, the Christian right is on the wrong side of a lot of issues. And so by just showing up, well, it may not be my issue. I may not be able to link it, link it to religion. These are my partners. These are my friends. I may not lead those causes, but it's important that we show up and support them. Are you open to religious people joining the effort and supporting atheists? As if we agree on an issue, absolutely. Okay. Like, I trained a pastor how to do comprehensive sex ed in the local public school. Okay. Absolutely. I, I marched with a, a nun on the Capitol to defend, to eliminate the death penalty. 
if we agree on an issue, I will put all of our differences aside and focus on that issue. Okay. If you want to argue with me about another issue, I'm happy to do that the next day. Even like semantics or anything. Semantics. Like do you want to talk about God, hell? You might you might be on the opposite end of protest signs on abortion. Mm -hmm. But if you agree with me on the death penalty and today's death penalty day, I'm gonna go hand in hand with you that day. Ask one last line of question. Do you think your position do you think your position in not believing in a God is more reasonable than believing in a God? currently with the amount of evidence that we have? Yes. Why do you think that? There's no facts or evidence. And this is what we want all of our legislators to do. We want people. Base your decisions on facts and evidence, not dogma or belief. I'm not saying I have it, but if you no. had evidence, would you change your mind on that idea? Absolutely. Okay, that's all I want to know. That's great. Thank you, Jim. Thank you. I had a wonderful chat. Five minutes. Awesome. Keep my word, baby. <laughs> I still got time on my... Did I talk to you about after?